Hey guys, Johnny here with Justina from Wildlife Preservation Canada. We're down doing a road mortality study at the Ojibwe Prairie. And we're out here documenting all vertebrates that we find dead on the road. And that's because reptiles are threatened by road mortality across Canada. And so we want to determine what species are found dead on the road and where so that we can best concentrate our efforts and hopes to reduce road mortality. So come for a ride and let's see what we can find. Christina, what did we find? So there's Justina taking notes. So basically we're recording all vertebrates you find dead on the road, but we're really focused on reptiles because we want to know what's being killed and where so that we can target our mitigation efforts and hopefully reduce this threat on the reptiles of the beautiful Ojibwe Prairie. What'd you find? Chipmunk. Another chipmunk? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Did you see something? It's a snake? Okay, we got a snake. Let's go check it out. What kind of snake is it? Uh, unknown snake. Oh, That's it's unknown. a crispy one, isn't it? Oh my gosh, you can hardly even tell it's a snake. Mm-hmm. Almost didn't see it. Good eye. Thanks. Hey guys, just leaving the field right now. Justina's gonna finish the rest of the survey. We're just training her up. This is her first day of the season. When I left her, we had 27 dead animals found on the road. Unfortunately, it included two turtles and a snake. And uh, it's not a lot, it's not our high time. In October, actually, we can get anywhere from 12 dead snakes on the road in a day to 91 dead snakes we had during one year. So this year, what we're gonna try to do is see if we can get permission from the city to do a temporary road closure during October when we get the highest amount of snake road mortality and then continue to do our road mortality surveys and see if there's an impact on mortality numbers and hopefully they go down. So stay tuned, we'll uh, keep you updated on how that goes and talk to you later.